Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Windows 11 without needing TPM 2.0 or Secure Boot, or more exactly, how to create a bootable USB drive with an ISO with Windows 11 that would automatically bypass the TPM and Secure Boot check. So before starting the video, you will need a Windows 11 ISO. If you don't know how to download the Windows 11 ISO, you can go down in the description where you'll have an article that explains to you step by step how to download the Windows 11 ISO with a media creation tool or how to download the Windows 11 ISO directly from the official Microsoft Windows 11 download page. So the article will be in the description down below and it's from our website, it's techbase.com. To create the bootable USB drive that will automatically bypass Windows 11 TPM and secure boot checks, we are going to use Rufus 3.16 Beta. The download link for this application will be in the article down below in the description that was made for this video. So it's gonna be the first link down below in the description. This beta version from Rufus 3.16 has a lot of changes, but the most important one is that they added a Windows 11 extended installation support that automatically disables TPM, secure boot, RAM requirements, and so on and so forth. So with this, you're gonna be able to create a bootable USB USB drive that will automatically bypass the TPM and secure boot checks. Of course, you're gonna need a USB drive. The size of it is recommended to be at least eight gigabytes. And of course, make sure to back up everything that you have on your USB drive in order to not lose any important data. In the device section, just select your device, in this case, the USB drive. In the boot selection, we're gonna select the Windows 11 ISO image and then click on open. And down here where we have image option, we have to click on it and then select extended Windows 11 installation no TPM, no secure boot, and no other checks. Select it, and basically like this, you can create a bootable USB drive with a Windows 11 ISO that will automatically bypass the TPM and secure boot checks. If you have a computer that is compatible with Windows 11, you can go for the standard option, which is standard Windows 11 installation, which will include TPM 2.0, secure boot, and eight gigs plus RAM. I'm gonna leave it as extended. Make sure that the partition scheme is GPT, and of course, UFI. On the volume label, you can enter a name that you would want your USB drive to be called, for example, Windows 11 ISO. And everything should be left as is. And after that, just click on the start button and make sure, as I've said, to back up all your data because you're going to receive this warning all data on device will be destroyed because the ISO will be overridden to this USB drive. Just click on OK after you've backed up everything from your USB drive so you won't lose any important information or data. And now wait for the process to be finished and the USB drive will be created with the Windows 11 ISO, as I've said, and this will automatically bypass the TPM and secure boot checks. And later on, you can use this ISO to boot up on another system or even on the current system by using the boot key that you have on your motherboard, or, or even you can double click on the setup once the bootable USB drive was created. So as I've said, now all you have to do is to wait for the process to be finished, and then we will be good to go. So now, as you can see, the process is finished, we can click on close, and if we access this PC, we're gonna see that the bootable USB drive was created. We can either double click on setup to start the Windows 11 installation, like this, or we can boot up using our boot key in order to do a clean install of our operating system. So you can do whatever you want, but this way you can go and install Windows 11 with no issues. Don't forget that in the description down below, you're gonna have the article where you will find the download link to Rufus, the beta version 3.16, and also the article that shows you how to download the Windows 11 ISO. All that will be in the description down below. If the video is useful, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.